I'm reporter J.J. Burton here in Hernando County at the Board of County Commissioners meeting. The big topic, manatees and the alarming number of them that are dying. People living on or near the Mud River packed Hernando County's Board of County Commissioners meeting Tuesday morning. They came out to discuss one thing, the number of manatees dying here. It's shocking, it's sad. Six, that's the amount of manatees found dead so far this year. That's more than 2021, 2022, and 2023 combined. This is unprecedented in our area. The big question, what's causing the deaths? According to the FWC, acute lethal gut shock from sudden dietary change caused a significant disruption in the manatee's digestive systems, enough to possibly kill. Some say it's toxic algae in the water, and others believe speeding boats are contributing to the deaths. It's a combination and they're all tied together because their causative facts are overuse, abuse, and decline of the river. Many of the commissioners say they're looking at all factors. To say uh, this is an emergency or an urgent issue is a, is a gross understatement. Commissioners say they're just as concerned, but Lucas Johns, who lives right on the Mud River, don't think they understand. The county has let the people down uh -huh. and these manatees down. Commissioners say there isn't much they can do because the FWC and the state have regulatory power when it comes to the Mud River and other areas. They discuss putting a task force together and requesting that the FWC make a bigger portion of the Mud River a no-wake zone in an effort to slow boats down. The meeting did end on a high note for many because the commissioners unanimously voted against a proposal from a business to rezone to commercial marina which some say could have put more boats in the river. Very thankful that the county commissioners are recognizing that we have a problem with the Mud River and that uh, we need to protect that river. In Hernando County, J.J. Burton, ABC Action News.